Hey, it's Carol with Crystals and Chai, and it dawned on me I haven't done a healing journey video in a while, so I'm doing that now. And I'm finishing off the nails I just put on. I do my own nails because I work with jewelry and everything else, and I'll link my jewelry channel below. Um, I usually do this type of nail, but I decided to do this type of nail. Just because I like to find different things and do different things. I do prefer Glamour Made and I'm not sponsored, but I thought I'd try. So we're going to finish off my nails now. <laughs> but this one is about my change in my name I did about a couple years ago. When I went from my nickname Carrie to my birth name Carol. It was quite the change. And basically... Carrie has a lot of healing. I went by Carrie my whole life. And I realized just how much damage had been done. I didn't even like to hear the name Carol because it was such a traumatic response. I mean, my dad named me. My mom didn't like it. And once they got divorced my name became Carrie no matter even my dad called me Carrie everyone called me Carrie if they called me anything else my mom would hear about it and she would say something like hey what so I didn't I my name change has a lot of feeling behind it growing up if anyone called me Carol I would cringe because when my mom would call me Carol Ann, my name is Carol Ann, I just don't have the Carol, the Ann behind it, um, when people would call me Carol, I would flinch, and I'm like, because my mom, my dad, anyone, if I did something wrong, it was, Carol Ann, what are you doing? Hey, stop that, Carol Ann, but if I was behaving myself, it was Carrie, and Basically, I need to, I think I need a little more healing on it. I definitely need to do a little more healing on it. But I'm making this video because the journey in the last few years from Carrie to Carol has been very interesting. These are turning out kind of nice. <laughs> I just... Honestly, it's like being reborn, almost. Only you're not. Because you look back at the life you've had. I mean, I've gone almost, what, half a century of being Carol? Of being Carrie instead of Carol? It's a reflex now. Carol. And Carol is beautiful. Both Carrie and Carol are beautiful. But Carrie now is healing and I'm just like, how can I explain this? There's a lot of maturity behind Carol. Carol has gone through the entire process only behind the shield of Carrie, if that makes any sense. And I look at the whole thing and I'm just like, and it had to be the right timing when I changed. And that I had a very spiritual What's the word for it? A spiritual event type thing. I had a meeting, I had an appointment with a, a friend, acquaintance, and they told me what I, some of my chakra records, and I just, it just clicked. Hey, this is what's going on and this is why. Carol needs nurturing. Carol is my inner child. Carol needs all of these things and I need to be giving this to her. So I had a ceremony a couple of years ago and when I did that, I'm sure some of you know I'm a witch. Maybe you don't, not sure. But anyway, I'm a witch. And when I did that, I also kind of put a spiritual bind on, not bind, but a spiritual type thing of where... I put boundaries. If people were going to hurt me, 
or they weren't going to be true to how I am or any of that, that it like a blockage. And I did it real well because and that's a whole other conversation. Whole other video. I just marked it down because for some reason it keeps slipping my mind. Guides are tricky. <laughs> anyway. Um... Sorry, I'm writing this down so I don't forget because that'll be my next video. But it's very, it's just basically being true to myself, being true to who I am, learning who I am, and being that person. And for some reason, it's like when I walk into a room, my energy has even changed. I don't know how it's possible. Well, yeah, when you do from when I did from one name to another, it's just been an experience. Some of it's been awesome, some of it not so awesome. I think my nails have turned out pretty well. I just the progress I have made has been awesome. The energies, I feel better. I feel better about myself. I feel better about me. I feel happy that Carol has her voice back because she was stuffed for a very long time. She was trapped for a very long time. And now I feel like she's coming back. It's been a lot of work, a lot of shadow work, because a lot of stuff happened in the last 50 years. And now that I'm 53, I just turned 53. Now that I'm in my early to middle 50s, I'm realizing just how much stuff happened. And I think I needed that one to the other in order to truly heal me, Carol Ann. That's also how Crystals and Chai came about, too. I don't know if I've actually shared that one. I better write that one down, too. I'm getting all kinds of notes from this little video. <laughs> it also helps that I talk to my auntie mom today, which is a whole other thing, too. Special person. I, I just... The, tr the journey has been interesting. It's been very eye-opening. It's been very loving. It's been very nurturing. It's been a lot of shadow work. Carol is a strong... I feel like I'm becoming myself, learning a lot about myself, not battering myself up all the time, just learning about me. And people have just come along the way that have known me half my life or all my life or whatever. They've just kind of like, okay, so this is you. This is awesome. A lot of me has changed just a little bit. A little feistier. A little more... I've been around a little bit. Don't bleep. You know, just... My energy has become different too. I think I'm kind of like blabbering a little bit, but... Have you gone through a name change? Any kind of name change. Because I literally did not get called Carol until, unless someone was mad at me, for 40 years. It's always Carrie, never Carol, unless they're mad. So now, it's a reflex. You know, someone calls me Carol. Even my husband, bless his, oh my gosh. He's been with me for 16 years, and he's like, Every, he calls me babe a lot because that's been my nickname you know fun nicknames so he just usually calls me that so that, and but when he's introducing me to somebody he's now got it down this is carol my wife which is awesome my friends hey carol my i call her my auntie mom because she's my aunt but she's more my mom so I call her my auntie mom, and I call my mom my birth mom because you can give birth to someone and not really be a mom, and that's another healing journey. <laughs> you forgive, but you never forget. And she's part of the reason why I was called Carrie all my life instead of Carol. 
I think I'll just conclude it right now just because I think I've got I don't know if I've talked more or rambled more for like the last 10 minutes I appreciate you hanging around with me and um, if you've had that name change for any reason let me know leave a comment you know it's all a journey it's a healing journey for whatever reason you've changed your name for some people it's what I did that was your birth name for some people it's a gender identity for some people it's a adoption type thing there's a lot of different reasons why people change their name but let me know in the comments how's your journey been have a beautiful day people and thanks for watching